Hey, this is John. Just uh, driving through Detroit here, and I know some of you aren't from here. Just, this is right down from where we live. Sorry if you can't see it, but I'm trying to trying to drive and do this at the same time. But all over Detroit, you've got burnt out buildings and uh, you know, here's another one all over. I mean, all over the place. And uh, this is a city desperately in need of massive, massive uh, just healing and reformation. And I uh, just wanted to give you an idea of kind of what what's going on around here. Of course, this is this is in Detroit. This is just about three minutes from our house, and uh, we live in uh, we live in Gross Point, Michigan. Which it's amazing, right? The 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 moment you cross over from Detroit into Gross Point, everything changes. I mean, instantly on that block. Um, you go from burnout buildings to a uh, very nice kind of a suburban area. Um, it's just a, just a very, very interesting, interesting place. Um, the, you know, I don't know, again, I don't know if you can see real well. I'm doing my best to not crash while I drive, but uh, this is uh, this is Chalmers. And, and the further you go out on Chalmers, boy, I'll tell you what, we went the other day to a church on Sunday morning, and it was insane. I mean, just the, the how many just burnt out buildings. There's another one right here. All over the place. I couldn't keep this rolling for just a, just a, another minute or two here. Um, you know, but our, our heart is to see just revival breakout is the only thing that's going to work. You know, you, you drive around and you see this type of devastation and there's just no social answer to this whatsoever. And uh, here we got, we got some more here, both sides of the road. And of course you've got homes right next to it where people are living and raising families and doing their best to you know, live their lives. So there's there's a lot of resiliency in this city. But uh, I'm just going to keep this going for another, I've got another couple blocks before I hit the highway. I'm on my way to a meeting for a web design client or a graphic design client. But uh, I'll just keep this going here for just a, just a little, little, little bit here. Here's another one, another building. And this isn't you know, this isn't just on this street. This is everywhere. I mean, this is all over Detroit. Everywhere you drive, you know, you're seeing this type of devastation and so tragic and sad. And and, and, and more than that, it, it, you know, there's such a feeling of hopelessness. How in the world can can we ever bring bring some healing to this area and I certainly don't have all the answers I mean my my heart is just to see the power of God arrive and then I think when that happens you know we're gonna there's gonna be some answers when 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 God's government is established here in Detroit I think there's gonna be order there's gonna be things that are gonna kick into place you know so I'm certainly not one that's sitting here with with all sorts of answers but you know I know God did move us here to uh, to be part of what's coming, what God wants to do, and so so yeah. Um, any way that you could participate would be absolutely amazing. You know, whatever that looks like. If it's you know, we need a thousand intercessors. That's been a it's been a, a prophecy that's been confirmed pretty powerfully. We need a thousand intercessors, not people that just sign up to pray, but people that are very active, they're prophetic, they're hearing God's voice, they're declaring the word of the Lord, they're reporting back to us, you know, what they're getting, what God's saying, these kinds of things. And uh, so we need that to happen. We need we need some, some radical financial support as well, you know, because that's uh, 
kind of par for the course, you know. We're looking for a day when that won't be as necessary, and I believe we're going to get there. But right now, we just we need some serious increase in finances. And uh, but yeah, here's just some more for you. I'll go ahead and shut this down in just a second. But uh, actually, got some nice little homes in here. But uh, guarantee you, in just a moment, we're going to see another one burnt out right next to, right next door to some of these. Maybe not. Almost up to the highway here. So anyway, so God does have plans and uh, exciting times. Yeah, here we go. Right over here, boarded up homes. And uh, there you have it. Now I'm at the highway. I'm going to go ahead and let you go. But I uh, just wanted to, I'm sorry, sorry that you couldn't see real well. I was all over the place with this camera, but... Um, yep, let me know what you think. Blessings.